Welcome back everybody. Since my last video, this is what's came in from the mail um, from Amazon. I'm not sure what it is. So we're just going to open it up real quick. I didn't want to do anything off camera just to keep you guys informed of what's going on uh, with our build. I'm not 100% sure on where we're going to go with it yet. Like as far as what kind of car. I'm thinking uh, I want to get like a Mustang or something just because that's the, the cheapest platform out there right now just to obviously to keep the cost down. So let's see what we got here. We got a box, a couple more boxes in here. All right. It looks like we got some knock sensors. If I'm not mistaken. Yep. So remember, our knock sensors were broken there when we got to the other engine. So we got a, a couple more, uh, more knock sensors from Delphi. And if you don't know, these are original equipment replacement. Uh, so that way you don't have any any pulse readings or a lot of noise or anything like that. If you get like if you went to uh, like some kind of Duralast stuff, and uh, here's. Some new wiring for it as well. So we needed that. I wasn't sure what it was. I honestly thought it was. I'm not gonna say what I thought it was. I, I know what I ordered, but I don't. I don't want to spoil anything. I kind of want to open everything I, I have on camera just to show, so you guys know what's going on. So there you have it. This is a little short update on that, and I'm gonna do another video. I started installing this oil. Here, let me stop this and Okay, guys. I got the camera on this little stick right here so I can show you guys what's going on. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get underneath the car I'm gonna show you how I got my oil cooler hooked up. It's not finished yet, it's just mounted underneath. I got it underneath here where the old cruise control ball used to be. So I took all that stuff out. I moved the battery to this side too. Because as you know, in these third gens, the battery's on the passenger side. So here's the oil cooler right there. How I got it tucked up in, in right there where that ball used to be. And it's a double fan oil cooler. And it's just, just tucked right in there. I still gotta run all the lines. Yeah, right there, it's got it capped off, these rubber rubber mounts, or rubber caps, whatever you wanna say. And I, I'm not sure if you guys can see in there, but that's how I, I got these little angle iron brackets that I used to mount that up there. So, that's that. And the, I don't know if you guys have ever seen underneath the car, but I don't really have anything hanging down. The lowest part is really these intercooler piping and way back there where the pipe, the crossover pipe is. But So that's that. I'll give you guys an update on that as well. There you go, guys. It's a short little update. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and uh, share with all your friends.